Today was a pretty interesting day on RuneScape. It started off by me making a video on the new Last Man Standing reward, the Truva Parchment, which allows you to use untradeables past 20 wilderness, which means for the first time I can use Void in Deep Wilderness. It doesn't come cheap though, each scroll is 1.5 mil plus a 500k fee, so an additional 10 mil risk. And the plan is to use this on a level 87 Voider, so I'm going to be targeted up with Pures. It's going to absolutely annihilate them. How you doing, mate? You TB'd. Right, let's do this. Look at the blister. <laughs> oh my, and he's just gonna protect melee, but he doesn't even know that I don't have melee. He definitely thinks I've got a Gmall or something. He's already running. He's literally already running. And good fight. It was that easy. It was that easy. Wow. And that was a KO. He still had bruise left. Void is just too good. But it's whether you want to risk this much. That's the question. 400k. Yes, that's perfect. Quick get to 20 wilderness. I can tell you to him. Oh, yes. Interesting. Okay. He could be anti PK, and that's a possibility. And the good thing on a BH world, doesn't matter the, these monsters are attacking me because target takes priority. He switched prayer and he's gone. Just about. There's the first upgrade, tier two. Hey, what the hell's this? Come here. You tap me. That was a bad idea, wasn't it? This guy's in trouble. That was difficult. Let's be sneaky and go for that guy whilst he's looting. Yep, got it. Got the full TB. <laughs> nice big fire surge. He's running away with protect melee up. Bad idea. Oh, 450k. That's actually a lot more than I thought, to be honest. Oh, he told it to me. Nice. Let's go. I wasn't expecting that. Let's go, buddy. Good luck. I'm gonna need it. Oh, look at that ballista. 49. It's just insane. 47. He's gonna try escape. That's no problem. Mythal Seeds. Hello. How are you doing today? He's already trying to escape. We've been fine about two seconds. He's dropping his stuff. Nah. How dare you? I'll be taking that. 280k. That guy right there was the only target who was a tribrider within four hours of roaming the wilderness. The only guy. I got a couple more guys in Edgeville Dungeon who were trying to anti-PK, a looter, and then I decided, fine, you know what? Let's just fight this level 103 piety account. What a great idea. And I, oh! And that is the story of how to lose a code I want. Nope. I'm not quite sure what went through my head to think I can take on two level 103 piety accounts. Well, the thing is, I actually took on one, but then the other guy rushed me. But we're back. We don't give up. What the hell is going on here? Eh? I'd rather take this guy, to be honest. Smited? No way, you gotta be joking me. Run. <laughs> I'm not being funny, but if my ballista, my dragon throwing axes just hit a bit more, that just wouldn't have happened. Yeah, this video is going really well, isn't it? There's basically just one thing left to do, and that is to stake to get the money back that we lost. It's as simple as it gets. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to say this guy. I was going to do 100 mil, but 150 mil will do. Let's do this. If we win this, we leave. Happy days. We made all our money back plus more. Surely it's not that hard, is it? Oh my god, that Rambo. I was winning up until that point, unless a tank. I love this game. <laughs> Mate, it's, it's just as simple as it gets. Now, this is where you got to be disciplined and teleport out. Right, happy days. Um, we're now, This video, we're now like 40 million profit. It's sick. It's going really well. I'm not sure what is going on in Bounty Hunter Worlds, but for that whole time, like I said, I got one tribrid target. I just couldn't find anyone to fight. So, for the first time in a very long time, Let's do a no-arm wrist fight. Look at all these people. Where have they appeared from? They heard that some free loot has entered the high-risk world. 
and everyone logs in, there are no whales in high risk worlds anymore, apart from me. I'm bringing out an AGS, let's do it. It's like we're risking like 20 mil or something dumb. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> oh, yes. You'd love to see it. <laughs> oh, my God. 19.5 mil. I'll take it. Yes. Get in there. That was a bit risky. But the risk paid off. Second. Easy, yes, Whip and Fury. I'm gonna stop whilst I'm up because I know for a fact I'm gonna get stacked for my entire HP. It's been a while since I've teleported to targets on the pure, and since I made the last video, tier 10s are now tradable, which is just really handy for selling them, really. And none of these have been bought. These have all been PK'd by myself, 16.2 mil worth. So I'm gonna PK with the Granite Hammer for the first time, cost one mil. I don't know, it's just a melee weapon for 50 attackers. And I'm also going to be PKing in full elders, so risking 3.7 mil. And they reset the KD or something. I'm not really too sure, but I've never died, so let's keep that up. Yeah, th I'd say this is probably the most popular combat bracket to teleport to targets on. Mate, this thing's garbage. Granite Hammer Smack. Granite Hammer Smack. Mate, this thing's actually garbage. What is this? This thing's... What? What is going on? Nah, this has to be... Nah, th this, this is a joke, right? Thank you. I'm not afraid to go to multi because, worst case scenario, I'll lose 7 mil. It's not like it's a Kodai. Tier 5? Yes, this guy's so screwed. He can't run to Hobgoblins. He has nowhere to run. He can't get a box with the Hobgoblins. This is what I love about BH World. He was a noob. I'll take the free upgrade. Can actually find, like, decent PK. And, okay, I guess we'll fight, screw it. A level 87, max 75 attack here, I'll show him his boss. And there we have it. Max 75 attack here, down. Tell you what, I'll go straight to my next target. No, he's on Ancients, and he's not even Scold. Oh, this is sick. I think he might only be 94 magic, you know. Because he can't barrage back because I keep on weakening his mage. Yeah, this guy's dumb. Tier 7. Free upgrade, found a looter. Look at this poor noob. You go on, I'll let you full TB me, I don't even care. Apparently the granite hammer can hit 34. But the main thing about this is that most people just can't range a lot. So it makes them pray something else. And then can get some big bolts off them. Because after you've used the Gmos spec, there's no need to camp melee anymore. No! His friend's still trying to PJ, for God's sake. Finally, the lens prey melee and <laughs> bolt to the face. Dragon long sword. <laughs> Mate, is it gonna be this easy? A l oh, it's not. It's not even a looter. He's just got absolutely no risk whatsoever. And cheers for the tier ten. One point eight mil to the bank. This is idea. Oh my god, is this guy in elders or is Zamar? Yeah, he's in Z elders. Zelda's? He's he's on ancient, so this is gonna be very difficult. Keep on draining his mate so he can't barrage. He's panicking, he's actually running. He's giving up on freezing. <laughs> yes, we got him. Sick. Good fight. Seer's ring, wizard boots as well. Nice. I outlasted someone by far who had barrage. I'm excited to see this lead, you know? He was risking a decent amount. Very respectable. 2.4 mil. Get in there. Literally, I'd say 75% of my targets are in multi. Let's see what's going on. Yeah. 50 wilderness? Single. Okay, this should be interesting. The hell's this guy doing? Mate, let's fight. I don't even care. Let's fight. I don't care that you're on Ancients. He thinks he's got the upper hand, but he doesn't know who he's up against. He's here on purpose, so he can fight people on Ancients without TBing them. Let's do the stepping under thing. We need to outlast this guy. He's getting absolutely destroyed. He should be gone here. I didn't even use my spec. Screw it, let's use it. Okay, that was kind of scuffed. <laughs> Wait, there was no way for me to teleport any- I don't have a slash weapon. Nah, like legit. How do I actually get out of here? Thank you. It's over. You know what, I don't even care, we're fighting. Let's go. <laughs> this is the worst idea I think I've ever had in my life. I'm literally venomed as well, this is not good. Uh -huh. 
tango down. Why did I think I'd be able to take on a level 81 in Void? I just, to be honest, he got chanced. He did. I don't know what goes through my brain sometimes. I'm an actual moron. Like, an actual idiot. <laughs> like, I tried escaping with one brew left. I'm, I'm getting a rematch. I'm gonna bring a Venom Potion. I don't even want his emblem either. We're taking this seriously. Yo, he's going down this time. This is the most unfair fight I think I've ever seen in my life. Imagine. Mate, he's running from me. Get him. He just got a gap. Surprise, mother- Mate, what is this? What's going on here? The hell, I wasn't expecting to see this guy. I like the look of that ballista, you know. 15 prey? He, he tallied up as well. <laughs> First blister of my life. He thinks he's gonna escape because he's got freezes. Actually so screwed. Oh my god. He thinks he's escaped, but he's just not. Anger fight. Sad. <laughs> he tallied to me. Berserkering? What was he thinking? Okay, I just made my money back. Sick. Even though I should have got that void, I'm still mad about that. I'm gonna be up tonight thinking about that. 3.7 mil. Damn. Found the voider again. Ah. No. What? How was I? Oh my god, how was I on defensive? <laughs> what the hell just happened? No, seriously. I have no idea. Oh my god, how did that happen? The main thing is, is that I am still up here. So you might have been wondering, where are the videos? Well, Last Man Standing got updated. It's finally not a prayer flicking contest and I'm just addicted, okay? Let me just show you what it's all about. And I'm actually sick of it. It's a tribe running contest, which is right on my street. DDSK already? Simple as it gets. So after you get someone, you get a key. I loot the chest, and that is a really good upgrade for the first one. So I've upgraded the rune plate legs and upgraded the rune crossbow. Looks like we got another fight. Ah, oh, too good. The only upgrade this guy had was a blessed spirit shield. I'll take it. Let's loot the key so we get. 17 players remaining, already got two kills. Arm skirt, we'll take that. A random magical loot crate spawn. What are we gonna get? Mage's butt, nah. Not worth. Let's go get that guy. He's got a staff of the dead. This is not good. And good fight already. Okay. So we got a staff upgrade, that's really good. Loot the chest. AGS and a fury, mate. This is some good luck right here. And he's out of the game. Okay, Torg's helm upgrade. Infernal cape, nah, already got fury. In fact, I'll take the claws. And I'll also take the staff so someone else can't pick that up as well. There's the AGS predicted, easy. He's not gonna predict these claws though. Like I said. Okay, top two. And no upgrades in the chest, okay. All right, let's go for the quick claw whilst he's not expecting it. And easy win. So, if you'd like to come over here and look at my scoreboard, shall we? So, um, 109 games played and 50 wins. So, pretty much every two games I win out of 24 people starting. I'd say that's pretty good. Unfortunately, the rank system is based off how much you play and not really the skill level. So, yeah, pretty interesting day on RuneScape. I almost got smited for two Kodai ones and got two defense but we actually made a very big profit in the end.